Hello everybody. Been a while since I have done a live video. Well, actually it's only been a couple days when I was on the other day talking about the uh, domestic violence podcast, but uh, another amazing day here in Norfolk. I'm here in Ocean View at uh, Carla's Diner, one of my favorite places uh, to have breakfast. And I'm not only here with Jada, Jada the boxer. I don't know if you guys will be able to see her. I can try to get her to come up and, and say hello, even though she's very, very, very shy, but there she is. And who else do I have? Come in the frame. Come in. Come hey. In. Hey, you no. take care of what, uh, <laughs> yeah. Right, right. Yeah. Okay, yeah, anytime, man. All right. There Tell your is. friends I'll be here five more minutes. <laughs> I'll sign autographs. Yeah. Hey, hey, what's going oh, on? Hello. Hey. Good to see you, Alfredo. It's wonderful to see how you. Are you? I'm doing ducky <laughs> is how I'm doing. Awesome, awesome. Um, well, we got finally a chance to meet in person. We did a podcast together that I'll link uh, to the description on this video. But uh, it was amazing to get a chance to eat some uh, brunch with you today here in Ocean View and to meet before I head out to England. So uh, what, what did you think about the I thought it was a there? wonderful, first of all, it was a wonderful meal. Okay, what's the name of this place? Carla's Diner. Boom. Yeah. If, you're, if you're anywhere near it, come over here. The pancakes were amazing. Better than IHOP. Yeah. You heard me, IHOP. <laughs> Better than you. Um, uh, also... Uh, it was wonderful. It's wonderful, uh, you, you know, um, as as we grow with our LinkedIn community mm -hmm. and we begin to network, um, every now and then this beautiful thing happens where you get to meet in person. I know. And and I and and you get that 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 wonderful. I've known you my whole life, but yet. I know. It, it's great. Yeah, it is. It's you know what it's like, pen pals. Yeah. If you're old enough to remember yeah. pen pals. Yes. That's exactly what it's like. It's like, and, and I'm meeting my pen pal yeah. right here. And it's wonderful. I love it. Thank you. Thank you. I know. And it's one of those things where like, you know, he was one of the first people I went to when I was dealing with my right shoulder and I had so many issues and I didn't know how to deal with the pain. And Alfredo's like, you just got to live with it. You you know, you're, you're just going to find a way to get past it. And at the time, I really didn't believe it. I was like, there's no way I'm going to be able to live with this. This is terrible. Oh, it's Carla's Beach House. Sorry, not Carla's Diner. Um, just saw the sign right there. So Carla's Beach House. But anyway, as I was saying, it is one of those things where you don't really know what you have out there in terms of your connections and in terms of people that will be there for you, in terms of people who will listen to your story until you just take that moment to put yourself out there for the right people. And uh, I did that today and I've done that for the past few months with you as awesome. a friend. And uh, you've always been so supportive of me. So I wanna well, you, thank you for that. Well, you're an amazing person. Well, thank you. You are. And, and, and um, you know, everybody has their difficulties. You have them, you're very open about them. I have them, I'm very open with them. But that's not what brings you value. No. You know, and that's not what defines you. And that's not what, what, what uh, you should not let that I see you, baby. <laughs> you should not let that assign value to you no um yeah because once once you've assigned it it makes others easier to assign that same value which is what you don't want i agree and like i've been telling you guys I've, i'm growing way more into who i'm supposed to be and what i'm supposed to be and embracing that person and it's wonderful to have a mentor like you alfredo oh why did you to, call me the m word i'm sorry but it is nice <laughs> to have somebody who's been there done that experienced some of the same things and can help you along your path and have those really meaningful conversations so um i encourage you guys when you make these connections on linkedin take take a moment uh to actually reach out to the people and if you're watching this on youtube because i'll probably post it there too since it's a longer video mm. and uh when you have these connections through social media, they can a lot of times turn into real connections. So don't dismiss the power of the connections that you're making through these platforms. Because as you can see here, he's a living example of, of what can happen uh, when you're open to connection and uh, just having a meaningful yeah. relationship. And so. um, uh, also I'm, I'm a living example. As she said, she's getting ready to become the new her. The her she should have always been. I didn't realize she wanted to be a fat, bald, Puerto Rican with, <laughs> with great hair. But here I am ready to model myself so that she can yeah. be what she needs to be. And embrace it. Embrace my weird, quirky self and yep. be 100% okay with that. Yes. So anyway. All right, guys. You enjoy the rest of your day. 
We will talk to you later. Bye now.